tip number one. Skip dialog or use the outer control description when adding controls. When we add a control in OCAD, we choose the control symbol and one of the drawing tools to place the control. Then usually the course object dialog is shown. Here we can change the code. If we don't want to sh show this dialog because the controls are just numbered each after the other, we can press the shift key and the controls are directly added by using the next available code. As another option for adding controls, we can use the automatic control description. Go to the course setting menu and automatic control description where you can enable this function. Choose the OCAD file that is loaded in the background map. Now, when we place a control, the symbol is added to column D of the control description. We may add more information to complete it. As an option, you can also click and drag on the object and then the side on of the control is also added to the control description. For linear objects like this narrow ride you can also drag and the end with the direction is shown in the control description. The same here, small erosion gully and south end. For contour objects, there is a rule. When you drag to the left, a re-entrant is shown in the control description. If you drag to the right, a spur is shown in the control description. If you drag down, a depression is shown, and if you drag up, a hill is shown. As an example, if I place a control here in this reentrant, it is shown in the control description. If I undo, and just for showing, place control here by dragging up it will show a hill. 